in the wild, just like in a good TV series. That's why nature is exciting to watch, because there's always something going on. Have you ever seen a wolverine in action? What about a caracal? If you're into disagreements and conflicts, you must watch this as we count down 15 insane animal battles recorded on camera. Number 15. Snake versus Lizard. This lizard taking a stroll on the sand takes a break, but he has no clue he's about to be ambushed by a snake. The snake has dug himself into the sand, waiting for an opportune moment to strike. When he does, it's all over for the lizard, and he is gobbled up by his friendly neighborhood friend. This python has killed a monitor lizard and is in the process of swallowing it in the water. It's taken recluse behind a rock to enjoy his meal in private. This snake holds this lizard in a stronghold. The lizard is still alive, barely breathing, but the snake has a good hold on it. It's so good, the snake thinks the lizard is dead, so he detaches his fangs and moves towards the head to swallow the lizard. But the lizard is still alive. I guess the snake doesn't care but it still takes the snake another seven minutes for the lizard to die and be entirely swallowed. Another lizard is snatched by a snake in the forest, and this snake doesn't waste any time eating the reptile. A snake tries killing a chameleon on the road, but the chameleon stands its ground and it puzzles the snake. The two observe one another, but nothing happens. A cobra is interested in this monitor lizard's latest find, a few scattered eggs on the ground. They both strut their stuff to intimidate one another. The cobra is poised to strike, and with that, the monitor lizard moves away, but not without striking the cobra on the head with its tail first. Now that the wizard is on his way out, the snake has the eggs all to himself, but when he approaches, he realizes the eggshells are empty. The monitor lizard has the last laugh. This king cobra has already killed this lizard and has begun to eat it. The Fanatic brings you all the best content you want to see when it comes to the animal kingdom. If you want to see the latest confrontations between animals and the best animal videos, please subscribe now. We post new videos every day for your entertainment. Number 14. Wolverines The wolverine is a strange species that looks like a honey badger but lives in a colder region. Instead of snakes, the wolverine is more likely to encounter wolves and bears on its journey. Most animals, especially bears, big cats, and wolves, avoid interactions with wolverines because of their ferocity, bravery, and fighting skills. The wolverine is fearless and difficult to catch. The wolf in this video tries to pull a wolverine out of its den, and it seems like it's going to be a cakewalk at first, but never count the wolverine out. The wolverine tumbles and stumbles, rolls over, bites. It's almost like the wolf is watching a circus act, but in the end, the wolf realizes it was part of the act when it ends up with nothing. Two wolves are fighting this wolverine in this conflict. Isn't this supposed to be simple? Wrong. Even though the two wolves are attempting to attack the wolverine from opposite directions, it is able to defend them off and becomes the aggressor. The wolves appear to be apprehensive, and they are once again left with nothing to eat. This showdown between two wolverines is epic. They are fighting over an animal carcass, and neither wants to concede one inch to the other. The semi-retractable claws come out, and the specialized teeth are barred. It's all out war! The defender gets the upper claw and wins his meal back. Its powerful jaws break down the entire animal, including hooves, teeth, and bones. This is his turf and his food. Wolverines are naturally hostile animals, but they become enraged when someone tries to steal their food. They become so enraged they will battle to the death, which is why this wolverine simply began following the helpless bear. The bear must have wondered who the nutjob following him up a tree was. I believe the bear was both terrified and shocked, but the wolverine persisted. Even if it had been a T-Rex, the wolverine would have jumped him in this situation. I'm wondering if honey badgers and wolverines are long lost cousins. The wolverine doesn't even back down when it's facing a puma. Watch this wolverine go on the offensive against the big cat, and the feline backs up and eventually runs away. In this video, this wolverine may have met his match when he tries pulling an American badger out of his den. The badger and the wolverine are both unpredictable and violent, so it's a great matchup. However, the badger is well positioned and entrenched, so it's difficult for the wolverine to progress. Hence, he abandons the attack. This wolverine is up against a couple of dogs and it stands its ground. The dogs try to find an angle of attack, but the wolverine doesn't let them. 
Reindeer are huge animals, but it doesn't stop this wolverine from jumping on this reindeer's head and trying to bring it down during a major snowstorm. Not only does the reindeer have to worry about the cold, it has to deal with the maniac attacking it. Number 12. Herons Many birds are skilled when it comes to hunting snakes, and the great blue heron is one of them. You can see this heron enjoying a snake after an easy kill. This duck feels threatened by the presence of this heron and decides to take it to the cleaners. The heron doesn't insist and takes off. This heron has snatched a duckling and is carrying it on its beak, occasionally soaking its head in the water before it swallows it in one gulp. Rabbits are another favorite of the heron, and this one just made this heron happy. This rabbit is also being dumped in the water before the heron eats it, because it makes the rabbit easier to swallow for the bird. A black-headed heron snatches a small bird and begins the dipping ritual before swallowing the bird. Herons also enjoy fishing, and this heron makes a nice catch. This heron catches a massive fish and must get to shore quickly so it doesn't lose it. It holds onto it and puts it in position, but it must make sure it's incapacitated. Once that's done, it swallows the entire fish in one gulp. Number 11. Secretary Bird vs. Snake The secretary bird is a huge raptor that looks like a cross between a hawk and an eagle. On the African grasslands, they are known for their capacity to destroy snakes. Dangerous prey such as snakes are first stunned and then killed by being pecked behind the neck. To flush prey out of hiding, the secretary bird stamps on the ground with its enormous stout-toed feet. Watch the secretary bird gulp a snake in its entirety in seconds. This secretary bird circles a king cobra. The cobra is on its guard as the bird begins its approach. The stomping begins and the cobra is squashed like an ant. A snake tries to escape a secretary bird and their bird pulls a few dance moves as it stomps on the snake and gets dinner ready. Another cobra is invited for dinner at the secretary bird's table, but the only problem is the cobra is the meal. A secretary bird stomps on a mole snake its wings are spread, and it almost looks like it's going to take off, but it's really performing a dance sequence from River Dance. For some reason, after dropping the snake, the secretary bird runs off without the reptile. This secretary bird isn't a cha-cha dancer. It's engaged in a fierce fight with a cobra. These birds have snake-killing abilities, including the ability to kill cobras, black mambas, and other venomous species, as you can see. This secretary bird snatches a snake and carries it in its mouth as it leaves the area. Number 10. Monitor Lizard Monitor lizards are large lizards that hunt snakes. Surprisingly enough, the monitor lizard in our video has a lot of ambition when it decides to tackle a python. Albeit it's not a large python, but it's still a dangerous snake for the lizard. And just when the snake begins to wrap itself around the lizard, the lizard bites it and pulls it out of there and begins to jerk the snake left and right. I don't know about you, but my money is on the lizard on this one. This monitor lizard is holding a rattlesnake tightly in its mouth, and the snake is trying to slither away, but the lizard is determined to eat the snake, and that's what it does. This monitor lizard bites into a snake, and it doesn't look like the snake is escaping his grip. This sand guana, a type of lizard, is engaged in a vicious fight with the snake. The snake is wrapped around the guana's head, so I'm not sure if the snake is winning or if it's the other way around. Number 9. Gorillas Gorillas live in groups and are social animals. A harem arrangement is common in gorilla groups, with one adult male or silverback living with multiple adult females and their children. The females will stay in the group if his leadership is successful. These two gorillas chase each other at a zoo and challenge one another to a fight. They never really engage, but it comes close at times. These two gorillas are engaged. Perhaps one of the gorillas is challenging the dominant male, so it can take over his harem. Who wouldn't want five or six females available for extracurricular activities at any time? These two gorillas are engaged in a wrestling match, with one of the gorillas trying to position himself behind the other, so he can better maneuver and win the arguments. These two are play fighting or arguing. I mean, it's one or the other, or perhaps the smaller guy is annoying the bigger one and tries to steal that piece of cloth from him. Number 8. Leopard Hunting Impala This impala is grabbed by a stealthy leopard, and after a lot of resistance and pulling away by the impala, the leopard takes control of the situation and completes the hunt successfully. 
a leopard jumps into Paula and tries to finish it off in the following video, which involves a lot of tumbling. Because the Impala is so enormous, the leopard has a difficult time neutralizing it. If the leopard does not make the kill immediately, it may become dangerous. The leopard, though, triumphs with a little sheer willpower. A gorgeous female leopard emerges from the jungle early in the morning and spots a group of unsuspecting Impala and gazelle. The animal hunts discreetly in the long grass, getting closer and closer to its prey, waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike, and then pounces quickly on a small Impala in a ditch. A friendly hyena smells the opportunity and approaches the ditch. The hyena goes to scare the leopard away, which it does. But at the same time, the leopard lets go of the impala. And with the impala still alive, it scampers off. And the hyena ends up asking the leopard why he let the impala go. When this leopard falls from a branch above, it lands just next to a herd of impalas. And the leopard kills one in a matter of seconds. It tries to carry its victim up a tree to keep it safe from scavengers and other predators but the animal is too heavy for the enormous cat, so it eats it on the ground. In seconds, this leopard leaps towards this impala and suffocates it to death. The leopard usually brings its prey atop a tree to protect it from other predators and scavengers. It is the only cat in Africa that does this. Number seven, Komodo versus deer. A Komodo dragon notices an injured deer standing in the water and decides to take a closer look. The Komodo walks into the water and brings the deer back to shore to eat it with an invited guest. This deer is disemboweled and torn to shreds by a community of Komodo dragons. I just hope there is enough for all the dragons to feel full. This deer has been bitten by a Komodo dragon and you can see the effects of the bite. The small Komodo waits around as the deer twitches and seems disoriented, constantly falling to the ground. Is the Komodo's bacteria causing this or something else? This Komodo is holding this deer by the tail in front of a crowd. Aren't these people afraid the Komodo drops the deer and chases them? Number six, elk. These two elks go head to head with just a guardrail standing in between them. At one point, one elk lets out a war cry that's quite impressive. The elks continue their little quarrel as the snow continues to fall. As the rut advances, bull's testosterone levels grow and as a result, Bulls encounter opponents who are vying for the female's attention. Some of the battles are brief scuffles, while others go longer. In most conflicts, injuries are common, thus they rarely become serious. Just watch how brutal an elk can be when it mangles another elk on the side of this mountain. Just when the elk is vulnerable, the other elk rams its antlers into its stomach. It shows no mercy at all, but the weaker elk is still able to escape. Two elks defy one another and get ready to charge each other, but they don't and let out a bunch of war cries instead without ever going to war. Number five, leopard versus monitor lizard. Because of their thick skin, monitor lizards aren't the best prey for leopards, but that doesn't imply leopards don't pursue or hunt them. The large cats don't seem to know what to do when they get a taste of this monitor lizard's medicine, so they just roam around and wonder what's going on. The lizard flicks its tail back and forth, occasionally hitting the leopard. After some thought, the leopard simply snatches the lizard by the neck and suffocates it. This leopard and this lizard are on a blind date. The leopard is shocked when it first meets the lizard because let's be frank, it's kind of scary looking. But the big cat has class and doesn't want to be impolite. So it lies next to the lizard and tries to make the best of the date. With the passage of time, the leopard realizes this date isn't going anywhere and decides to break the date. According to what I've heard, it canceled its membership on Match.com. A leopard finds a lizard during its morning walk and isn't too interested in the reptile, so it decides to take another path. Number four, Caracals. The Caracal is a carnivore, which feeds on small mammals, birds, and rodents. It has the ability to leap up to 12 feet in the air and catch birds mid-flight. It stalks its prey until it is within 16 feet of it, then bites the throat or rear of the neck to kill it. This caracal just hunted a savanna hare and is carrying it in its mouth. The hunt took place in the tall grass, so there wasn't much to see. This caracal chases a small bird, and just when you think the bird is escaping, that's when the caracal gets its paws on it and kills it. A caracal sneaks up on a warhog and the chase is on. The caracal is fast, but so is the warhog, so I'm not sure the cat will make the kill. The caracal has made a kill, and these two jackals want a piece of the action. They corner the cat and rip off his meal. 
Number three, magpies. Magpies are cunning and territorial and don't hesitate to attack when an intruder is close to their nest. This squirrel jumps up to this magpie, but it's in for a surprise when the magpie attacks it. It bites the squirrel and drags it to the ground. The squirrel doesn't do much except complain. This big bunny rabbit is surrounded by magpies. The birds prepare to attack, but the bunny stands its ground. This cat isn't impressed at all by a magpie that keeps flying right above it. Is the magpie planning an attack, or is it just trying to annoy the cat so it leaves? I'm guessing the cat is too close to the nest and the magpie doesn't like it. It's difficult to tell what is going on during the scuffle, but there are definitely a few magpies involved. This magpie attacks a rat on the street. It constantly pecks at the rodent until it kills it. These magpies destroy a hawfish in seconds and the victim doesn't even have time to blink. The attack was so lethal and quick. Number two, baboons. Baboons often work together. Believe it or not, but these baboons are taking on a crocodile. By ganging up on the crocodile, they give themselves a chance of surviving against the mighty predator. This male baboon carries a lion cub up in a tree and holds it as if it was its own. The baboon grooms the cub and the cub is practically immobile. It's not clear why the baboon took the cub, but it doesn't look like it wants to harm it. A leopard is taunted by a troop of baboons, and when they get too close for comfort, the leopard decides to take off with the baboons chasing it. The leopard is quick enough to escape safely. This baboon takes down a young impala, and the impala's mother tries to move the baboon away. But the baboon doesn't budge and eats the impala. This baboon likes pink, and he takes a run at a bunch of flamingos, but all the birds take off as the baboon approaches. However, don't count the primate out, because he manages to chase one of the flamingos and grabs it at the last second. That was one hell of a run. Number 1. Grizzly Bear Fighting when two bears fight, it can become violent and scary. You can see in these videos how aggressive these bears are and how they bite and scratch each other during a fight. When they're not wrestling, their claws and teeth can be lethal. One of the bears in this video stands at about 7 feet tall and weighs 800 pounds. The other bear is smaller, but he asserts his dominance by stretching his neck, flattening his ears, and barring his teeth. The smaller bear prevents the larger bear from using his height by raising his front legs. The smaller bear manages to land the fatal blow to the face, which causes the larger bear to flee. These two giant Alaskan grizzlies look like two sumo wrestlers as they stand up and push each other with all their might. After a long battle, both bears are exhausted and take a break. They don't look like they're interested in continuing. They just want to rest and take it easy. All these animals are impressive but I'm always in awe of the caracal when I see it. What an original looking specimen.